Coming to you live from Slayman Main Stadium in Terra Bay, home of the Mutineers. The stadium is filled to capacity, and this crowd is really feeling it. Grim, pirates don't feel much unless the feelings include the rust they get from gutting a man from head to toe and spill his guts out onto the dock. Well, you got that right, partner. Let's play some football. Today's matchup promises severed limbs and ruined careers. The Orcs of Hazard battle, the Terror Bay Mutineers. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. See that move, baby? I'm the greatest. No, you didn't see that because I'm too fast. <laughs> hey, go Gango, man, kill. Come on, get on, get on, get on, get on, get on. Hi again, everyone. Grim Blitzrow here, along with the only guy to ever get cut from the league for testing positive for not taking enough steroids or mutant growth hormones, Brickhead Mulligan. Hey, there was a reason for that. I had to quit taking steroids. My nutsack was shrinking, and I sprouted this mini me on my shoulder. Bricks Jr., take me out. You're a pussy. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot he broke free and has open field in front of him. The 20. The 10. They're gaining on him. Hey, come on, move your ass. I got a soft up right on this asshole. Hey, man, you see that? That's right, you can't handle this. You can't handle what I've got. Yeah, get the hell out of here, man. Don't try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? You have got to be kidding me. My sister could have made that kick. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. Not a bad kick, but not a great one either. Well, his nickname is Lukewarm. And he's proud of that? Yeah, that's why he named his clothing company Lukewarm Threads. Their marketing team hates it. And it's first and ten. Second down in a lot. And the quarterback finds his man for the first down. I was And it's first and ten. Hitting mid hurdle and fumbles the ball. Second and three. Murphy Brown. What? I mean, first down. What the hell was that? I, uh, I honestly don't know, Grim. Ran into the line at the DMV. And guess what, Grim? That line ain't moving. Yeah, that was kind of my point, Bricks. Second down and ten. Call man about a six yard gain. Hey, do me a favor. If my parole officer calls, I was with you last night, Bricks. No problem. I spent the night in lockup for solicitation. It's a catch for a one-yard gain. That's not going to do it, fellas. The drive was stalled, and here comes the field goal attempt. And it's good! You know, Grim, in this league where murder and bribery are cheered, it's good to be good, huh? I mean, can't we all just... Not this shit again. Bricks, I'm stopping it right there. He's going to be able to run.
run this one back. I wonder if the kicker was setting up an easy kill. Oh, with the brain scrambler. Uh. And it's first to ten. Hot one, hot two. Eight. And he reels that one in for a first down to keep the drive alive. And it's first and ten. Ooh, that hit's gonna shave a few days off his life. Second down and nine. point attempt. And he misses that extra point. Oh, well, look at clown shoes down there. Is he wearing actual clown shoes? I think so. It's probably why he missed. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. Sends him to the ground with an exclamation point. And a well-placed cleat. And it's first and ten. He runs it for three. Second down and seven. Say maybe three yards, but a tough three yards. Third and four. Catch the ball, get the first down, and don't die. See, it's really a simple game when it comes down to it. And it's first and ten. Running like he had a load in his pants. Picks up maybe two. Uh, we always ran with a load in our pants, Grim. It's a pretty good defensive tool. Yeah, except the zombies. They are freaks. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. for the first down. Yeah, man, I was hanging on the now. You know what happened? <laughs> First down and six. <laughs> and that'll be second and eight to go. Chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> it goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. And we've got a tight battle here as quarter one comes to an end. Finally. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. Hot one, hot two, hot three. 
game is starting to soften up the defense. First down. And it's first and ten. First down. Give this guy a few catches and watch his confidence take off. He is deadly in the open field, Bricks. First down and three. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Second down and six. It's about a three yard pickup. Third and four. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot. Eight. And he just nailed him right on the numbers for a touchdown. And that, my friend, is the dance of someone who knows they can negotiate for more money next year. I call that shake, rattle, and bone. <laughs> and they line up for the extra point. Straight through the uprights. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. They're going to be able to return this one. Oh, what a punishing hit that was. And that's how you make a guy remember your name and your shoe size. Because he just walked all over him. And it's first and ten. One time, when I was playing, a guy hit me so hard, I went into a dark tunnel. Thought I saw my grandparents waving at me in the light. Turns out it was just the visitor's tunnel that he knocked me into, and it was the paramedics waving fingers in my face. Well, he just heard footsteps and took his eye off the ball. What a peck ahead. Get the ball, asshole. Third and two. And that's a run for no gain. Then it's not really a run, is it? <laughs> well, here comes the punting unit. You know, punters really do know how to party, Bricks. Yeah? Oh, yeah, I have pictures that, uh, that well, maybe actually shouldn't discuss this on here. He's got the ball now. Let's see what he does with it. What a hit that was. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two. That's the way to move the chains. That's good for a first down. This game is all about momentum and killing. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot. Three. Nice pickup for six yards. And that'll be second down and four. for a second there. Third and four. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot three. It was a risky throw in the defense. You can't keep a good mutant down. Oh, man. He just laid the wood on that guy. Yeah, if you're going to hit a guy that hard, you should at least kill him. Do him a favor. Finish him. <laughs> and it's first and ten. It's a six yard gain. 
The warning sounds only two minutes left in the first half. And that'll be second down and four. Two minutes of timeout means the QB is playing beat the clock, and he better win. Third down and five. This guy's going to get mugged in the locker room by his team after the game. You know, sometimes the best thing to do is just punt and let your defense get the ball back. The punter for today is being played by my kid's sister. Or at least it seems like it. He's got the ball now and is going to try and score. Oh, nice hit. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot. And he runs it for four yards. Second down and six. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Hot. First down. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. 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 Smart move there, stopping the clock with their first time out. And for all you know, maybe he's just stalling or wiring the ref some cash. Thank God he's still got his leg. He's going to need all of it for this kick. And I don't want to see the comment section on that replay of the kick. Yeesh. That was terrible. Yeah, he's going to get the right Funko treatment after that, miss. And then it's a first down from a great catch. Was it a catch, though? Let's consult it. And that's the end of the second quarter. Someone will need to pull together some bribe money as they head to their lockers. Stay with us for the halftime show, brought to you by our friends at Monsatan Industries. We make genetically altered Franken food you'll have fun trying to identify. We're back for the second half as the teams line up for the kickoff. The coach told his players they'll be strung up on the goalposts if they don't make this a game in the second half. That's how you motivate these pricks. <laughs> The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. shots like that over your career? Ah, uh, let's see. About a quarter after three, Grim, but my watch is a bit slow. And he literals the ball and misses target. A pickup of about three on that play. Second down and seven. No, you didn't. You know why? I'm too fast for you. I'm the greatest. The greatest, I tell you. <laughs> Third down and... 
The pucker is warming up. And then Katz will give them a first down. I don't know if they're his, but he sure has a good set of hands. And it's first and ten. Knocked him into the next time zone. Once he finds his head, he'll be okay. Second down and six. He caught it, and nothing was going to stop him from getting into the end zone. Except maybe self doubt, but he seems to have worked through it. Well, this shouldn't be easy, but with kickers, you never know. And the easiest play in the league, and he chokes. Yeah, he's a choker. He's a big night smoker. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. First and ten. Hot. Hot one, hot two, hot three. And he picks up about six on the play. And that'll be second down and four. Hot one, hot two. one in for the first down. No, seriously, man, you think you go toe-to-toe -to -toe with me? You get my grill, I'll ruin your world. Ruin it. And it's first and ten. You want dirt and some fun on your time. Second down and long. Call man about a six yard gain. Hey, do me a favor. If my parole officer calls, I was with you last night, Bricks. No problem. I spent the night in locked up for solicitation. Oh, and the quarterback threads the needle for a first down. First down and one. Hot. Hot one. Hot. And the crowd goes wild. Touchdown. Touchdown. Don't try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? You gotta be kidding me! My sister could have made that kick! Isn't your sister in a wheelchair? I know, right? The teams are lined up for the kickoff. And that's a returnable ball. Returnable? You mean he can get a refund for it? No, no, Bricks. It means he can return it for... You know what? Never mind. First and ten. And he sends him to the ground with an exclamation point. And a well-placed cleat. Second down and nine. needs a miracle. I don't know whose eyes the QB is using, but can we get him some new ones? He scores! He earned those points on the heels of an epic run. Nah, don't call things epic, Grim. Kids aren't going to think you're cool no matter what you do. Junior, I don't 
want kids to think I'm cool. Man, are these guys greedy or desperate? Either way, they're going for two. team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five! <laughs> and it's first and ten. Catch that. Second down and ten. Catch the ball, get the first down, and don't die. See, it's really a simple game when it comes down to it. And it's first and ten. First down and nine. And he breaks through for a touchdown. Listen to this crowd. Yay. Hey, man, I was hanging on the kettle now. You know what happened? And these guys think kicking is for pussies, Bricks. They're going for two. Yeah, they got big balls, Grim. Yeah, dig it in your eyes. He caught it. That's two points and even more momentum on their side. I can feel the momentum shifting. For the last time, you're not a Jedi, Bricks. <laughs> When you get knocked down, you gotta get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. Pow! And how about a little dirt sandwich? <laughs> and it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. And that's the way to get the sticks moving. He picks up five on that play. Second down and five. And he's running like a moose right now. Caught for the first down. Yo, man, nobody can touch you an eyeball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. What you talking about? The third quarter has ended, and we'll need a huge rally or a high death toll to make this one interesting. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot. Second down and more than the QB would like. One, hot two, hot, hot, hot. Oh, great pass on that play. They caught the defense napping.
And that'll bring up third down and seven. That's a killer. It was right there, and then he dropped it. Oh, scumbag is killing me in the fantasy league. And this field goal is certainly within the kicker's range. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just guineas. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. First and ten. Normally that would be a first down, but he had a whole lot of ground to make up. Second down, the size of Bricks Wiener. Hey! Sorry, partner. And he punched his way out of that. Oh, this guy just loves punishing the defenders. That's a first down. And it's first and ten. And that's some good old-fashioned downhill running as he picks up nine yards on the play. And that'll bring up second and one. And the quarterback finds his man for the first down. First and ten. Maybe the QB should throw it and catch it too. <laughs> Second down and ten. It's two yard run before he stopped. Third down and eight. And he put on the afterburners after that catch and scored. Nicely done. Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. Couldn't hit the side of a fallout shelter. <laughs> they need a good return here to set up the offense. He sets up for the return. Let's see if he can break one wide open. First and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. And that's how you run the football. First down. And it's first and ten. Nice pickup for six yards. Second down and four. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot three. He was stuffed at the line of scrimmage. So was that cheerleader. Third and four. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot three. And he snatches that one out of the air for a first down. See if they can get something going here. It's first and ten. And he reels that one in for a first down to keep the drive alive. And it's 
first and ten. He picks up a two. And that'll be second and eight to go. Not one. And that's another pick. Man, oh, man, the defense is going to have more receptions than the offense. Oh, what a brutal hit. And it's first and ten. You ever get hit in the head with a boat all grim? Nope. Well, I have on several occasions. Not surprising. Multiple times on each occasion. Not surprising. And trust me, that hit was worse. And they quickly call a timeout to stop the clock. And it's first and ten. And he zings it in there for a nine-yard completion. They are moving the ball now with authority. They use their second timeout, but they are running out of time. A bit pessimistic, don't you think so, Grim? It's more about building tension, Bricks. That's all we do at this point, and drink this bourbon. Come on, give me that. Ah, oh, sure, now he catches it. I had this guy on my fantasy team last week. I lost so much money on him, not to mention my kneecaps. My loan shark is very anal about collecting my money on time, Grim. And that's the last time out. They can't stop the clock anymore. Can any of us really stop the clock, Grim? I mean, when it comes right down to it, are we not all united by the constant reminder of our own mortality? Of that constant, relentless advance? If only it was as easy as telling them time out to stop our own clock. You know, Grim? Truer words never spoken, my friend. When in a hurry-up offense, the offense needs to run out of bounds or take a timeout to stop the clock. Oh, big catch! Big run! Big touchdown! Yeah, big deal. Mr. Meat for Brain Graham with a ball and didn't fall down. Oh, Silla! I will heal an old Silla! Should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> and then, my friends, is why the world hates kickers. I kind of feel sorry for him. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. Oh, it's a punishing hit. First and ten. Hot one, hot two. And this guy's running like an old guy looking for a bathroom. First down. And it's first and ten. Nicely done for a first down. That's right, folks. It's all tied up, and we are headed to overtime. I don't know how many players are left alive, but the rest are headed to sudden death. They should call this game Mutant Death League. Breaks overtime is a war with some basic rules. The first touchdown wins the game, but if the team that receives the kickoff gets a field goal, then the other team is allowed a possession too. After that, whomever scores wins. Ah, uh, Grandma, I didn't understand any of that. Can you repeat it? Not a chance. And it's first and ten. Hot one. for a first down. And 
It's first and ten. Hot, hot one. Footsteps and took his eye off the ball. What a peck ahead. Get the ball, asshole. Hey, asshole, up here. Talking to you. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hey. comes the most underrated position in football, the mighty punter. And he booted a high arcing rainbow. Nice catch, and he turns on the afterburners. Punt returners in this league have a life expectant. Oh, and that's when it feels like to have your teeth removed without Novocaine. If I had all my teeth knocked out like that, I'd have them made at the dice grin. It'd be fun to gamble with my own teeth. Second down in a lot. Smart. Time to punt. Whoa, whoa, you can't say that on the radio. And he got it off. That's a decent punt. The return man catches the ball and heads upfield. Boom! And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. But Bricks' mom decided to move back in with us. Second down and two. Just some good old downhill running there as he picks up the first down. And it's first and ten. That run is good for nine yards. And that'll bring up second and one. Quarterback passes for a touchdown. See that boom, baby? I'm the greatest. No, you didn't see it. Mitties, the mutineers get the opposition and are victorious. That was one hell of a slugfest. That was worth the price of admission, right, guys? Well, I paid for admission. I just kept girls dancing on a pole or something. Girls, man, I'm about a lap dance. You don't even have a lap, you little freakazoid. Follow me. Let's see what the MVP has to say about today's outcome. Once again, the folks at Evil SM thank our viewing audience and the Mutant Football League for allowing us to telecast this sports presentation. This is Grim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. signing off. Today's final game stats are brought to you by the Microheart Corporation. They get it right every up.